Hey everyone, I am in Salt Lake City today. I don't get to come up here very often now that I'm in real estate and not construction and stay in the Wasatch, Wasatch back more. But I just had lunch at Crown Burger here on North Temple. And if you've never had lunch at Crown Burger, you gotta put that on your bucket bucket list. It is, it is great food. Their uh, pastrami on their Crown Burger is so good. But I just wanted to point out a couple of things. It is fun to see what's happening in Salt Lake. As I looked across from Crown Burger, there used to be a uh, hotel it's called Temple Inn, and they demolished it last last year. You can see it right there, location, and they're building a new uh, multi-unit residential complex or building. It's uh, have 240 units in it, and has a couple floors of, of parking structure. So it's just it's exciting to see that they've got some housing going in here. I know that uh, Salt Lake passed some uh, changes to their zoning around their transit areas so that they encourage more um, restaurants and cafes and shops and that on the ground level. And, and I, I don't know if this will have it, but it's, it's exciting to see. But this is close to the Triad Center, close to the Gateway. Uh, you can see right down here that old building with the, uh, the water tower, the red building. Uh, the Salt Lake Hardware Building. That is the coolest building. Years ago, uh, back in the early 90s, I had an opportunity to go in there before they started doing some remodeling. And the building was built in the early 1900s. And at the time, uh, it had like some five acres uh, of floor space. It was the biggest warehouse type building west of, uh, I think, Chicago is what I'd heard. And anyway, they, they uh, Oh, uh, gastronomy, I think, is who it was that bought the building and and did a lot of restoration on it. It's a really neat building, and now they've uh, they've got some other residential and office class A office space over there by the the hardware building. So anyway, fun to be in Salt Lake. I uh, I'm glad we don't have the inversion. Nice to have some beautiful snow, but I do like living in the Wasatch back. So if you're in Salt Lake and you want a second home or a home in the Wasatch back get a hold of me I'd love to help you uh, find a place up there and then you can come to Salt Lake and visit like what I do anyway take care everyone and we'll stay in touch